welcome back to my channel. I just came back from work, so that's why I'm looking a mess. I wanted to do a lot more stuff for Halloween, but I don't know. I was just really busy this month. For today's video, I've been wanting to do a zombie pop art look for a long time. And I knew I wanted the base color to be yellow because I barely use my yellow. So I wanted to use it today. And then, so I got inspiration from this picture right here. The artist's name is, please hold, Nika Hauptmann. I'm sorry if I pronounced that incorrectly. I got inspiration from her look. That's like my main inspiration, but I'm gonna add some of my little stuff to it. So we'll just see where this goes. I wasn't even planning on filming today, but here we are. If you don't already, follow me on Instagram at Steph underscore flamenco with two O's. If you decide to recreate any of my looks that I've done in the past or this one or anything, just make sure to tag me so I can share it. <sighs> I'm so sad. <laughs> Today was the first day I went back to work after a four month maternity leave. So very sad, but really excited too. I'm not gonna try to let that affect my uploading schedule. I know I kind of fell off a bit it's so hard okay so without further ado let's get on to the tutorial usually i don't talk during these type of looks because i feel like i just ramble too much and then i get so focused so whoa um i get so focused on what i'm doing i just stop talking so if i do i'll just go over with voiceover I'm gonna wear a wig with this, but I'm gonna put it on towards the end. I feel like that's gonna be the easiest. I don't know. We'll see. This is a NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk. I don't know if I'm gonna take off my makeup. I'll just whatever. Go over it. I should probably remove my lipstick first. I want to thank all my new subscribers. Welcome to the Familia. I've been getting a lot of requests for more Spanish tutorials. But I felt like my last one was so awkward, like I have to re redeem myself. Make sure you make sure you know. I'm going to lay my eyebrows down. My eyebrows are disgusting right now. I usually have them really fleeky, but I haven't been able to go and get them threaded i haven't been able to get my nails done sorry guys i'm just laying my eyebrows down because it just it looks cleaner i'm just getting an idea of where i want these eyeballs and holes to be at so that's what i'm doing right now i will be going in with a concealer brush this is the d morphe m224 especially for like applying these types of colors i've been using this one lately Probably gonna just have to tie my hair. Yeah, let me just tie my hair. This video is actually intended to go up before Halloween, but I returned back to work like October 28th, and girl, it has been so hard adjusting. I feel like I just came back from summer vacation and going back to school. That's exactly what it feels like. It's like senioritis all over again. For the red, I'm using a red water activated body paint. This is from Tag. I love this body paint. The colors are super vibrant and dry to the touch. By the way, I have entered James Charles' casting call for his makeup reality show. He's going to be doing it here on YouTube. So if you want to support me or if you want to see me on the show, go show some love, comment, like my last video, and comment also on James Charles' video to let him know that you guys want to see me on the show. Hey, cry baby. Hey, my son. Hey, what are you doing that way? <laughs> okay, 
Okay, so I think this is what makes a huge difference in the makeup is the shading. I'm just going in with a, a black grease paint, outlining it and then blending it inward. This gives the look more dimension. I also set my face with the Morphe Bacon Set Powder and also setting the black with some black eyeshadow so that it lasts longer. I'm adding some details with a thin brush. Are you guys ready for the holidays? I am not. Totally not. Not prepared at all. I can't believe this year is like basically over. Oh yeah, and how can I not talk about us hitting over 1,000 subscribers? I am so, 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 so thankful. You have no idea how hard I have worked to get to 1,000 subscribers. This was a personal goal for me to hit a thousand before the end of the year and I did it with your guys' help. Thank you so much for all the love and support in my James Charles casting video. Oh my gosh, the amount of support is like overwhelming and I can't thank everyone enough who has gone out of the way and left a beautiful comment. It means absolutely so much to me. Thank you, thank you, thank you times a million. Love you guys. This is why you should put your contacts on when you start the makeup because my eyes are watering and I messed up my eyeball and I'm stressed. Now I just want to punch myself. Alright guys, I want to know what type of looks do you guys want me to be posting because obviously spooky season is over but I don't know. Maybe I can like start doing like getting into editorial makeup avant-garde makeup i don't know i don't know i just don't feel like inspired of doing like a regular cut crease like i feel like you guys don't even watch those videos what do you guys want to see from me help me out because i i don't know what i want to do right now or do you guys want to see more challenges or mom videos but i have so many ideas but i don't know what you guys are gonna watch because I don't want to put so much effort into something if you guys aren't going to watch it. Please help me. Okay, I know I already talked about this, but this is all I'm literally thinking about. What if I get chosen to be on James Charles show? Dude, I'm going to be so hurt if I don't. I'm going to be so sad. It would be such a big, big, big opportunity. I'm literally thinking about it 24-7. And December 11th, I cannot come any sooner because I am going crazy I I'm even dreaming about it like what I think I'm overthinking it I really don't want to get my hopes up but I just I have such a good feeling about this oh my god why do we not even get picked how embarrassing it's okay fun fact if you haven't already noticed I am a really big overthinker Exactly what I did here, I'm gonna just repeat the same steps down here. Um, I'm not gonna record it just because I don't wanna bore you guys. And then we're gonna come back, add a wig. I will be back shortly. So I'm gonna try something. Let's see if this works. So I just have regular um, plastic wrapping. Back like this. Hopefully this comes out cool. Okay, take your plastic. This is kind of the shape of roux that I'm looking for. So what I'm trying to do is a brain. I was going to put liquid latex here, but honestly, I'm not trying to lose baby hairs. Okay, so long story short, I did not like how my brain turned out. I wish I would have put more effort into it. Just after doing makeup for eight hours, sitting on the floor, I was done, okay? I was ready to go to sleep. I worked that day, so uh, I wish I, I could have either not done it or put more effort into it. Oh 
Hopefully it looks like a brain from afar. I don't know what I'm doing. This completes the look, guys. Wish I was going out somewhere. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Don't forget to hit that sub, like, and bell button. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.